How is it going everyone? Welcome back to a brand new video. It is Sunday, it is 10 a.m. and that means it's time for a brand new I Rate Your Teens video. For cheap, fast and reliable foot coins, check out u7buy.com. There is a link in the description and use the code HABER to get yourself a discount on all of your orders. If you are new to the series, it's a series where I rate your teams based on your uh, screenshots over on Twitter. Uh, I check out hasty screenshots like Aqua has sent in here uh, using the hashtag It's Haber. So if you want to get involved, send me a hasty screenshot of your screen squad using the hashtag it's Haber and let me know about your squad how many coins have you got who's tradable slash untradable uh just give me a kind of description of anything and everything that i need to know about your squad so i can help you in the best possible way that i can so we're starting off with aqua's team who hasn't really given me much to work off here he's basically just sent me his team but i guess i'll just give it a quick rating so he's playing a four triple two in game by the looks of things based on his uh team name it's a decent looking team to be fair it's a good team um varan is really good i would probably recommend over at left center back um, I was going to say Diego Carlos, but you actually can't game it on chemistry. Diego Carlos has to be the most overpowered centre-back I've used this year, bar Joe Gomez. Joe Gomez is the most ridiculous centre-back on this game. That includes Vidic, that includes Rio Ferdinand, that includes Van Dijk. Joe Gomez is on another level of just broken, cracked, incredible. He's so good. Um, but I tell you what, Varane comes pretty close. This is a really good team, to be honest. Um, I don't know your budget, so I can't really help you based on your your budget or anything like that. But what I will say is rating out of 10, this is a solid, I would say a nine and a half out of 10, given it's so early into the game, you've already got this incredible team. Um, the the points I would say that get knocked off, not, not a big fan of Alba. I understand why you've got Jordi Alba, just not a big fan of Alba. Um, as well as not a fan of playing plays off chem. At the start of the game, it's fine, but I'm still not the greatest fan of playing players of chem, even at the start. And then you've just got no chem stars on anybody. Like, I don't know what's going on here, but get some chem stars on players. But apart from that, it's a sick team, mate. Next one coming from Elliot Pryor. Uh, it says, GG, man, great stream today. We should play again sometime. Uh, I played Elliot on stream today on my Xbox Road to Glory. He beat me 3-1. Uh, good player. Joe Gomez was so ridiculous in that game as well. Uh, but he's got a decent team. He's got Lone Sterling. So I'm guessing you're going with Jota over at left mid when your Lone Sterling runs out. It's a really good team, to be fair. With the amount you've spent on the wants to watch version of these cards, though, like you could sell Bale, for example, and get yourself normal Bale and, and maybe get Kante in the midfield. Um, as well as maybe you could sell wants to watch Allen, get normal Allen, and get yourself, uh, I don't know, a better right center back, for example, maybe Davinson Sanchez or someone like that. Um, apart from that, everything else seems really, really good. Alex Tellers, absolutely perfect. Uh, you might even be able to see here. My desktop background is actually Alex Tellers. Rival fans in the comments down below are going to have an absolute field day, but I like Alex Tellers, man. I think he's a really good football player, and I can't wait to watch him in a main night shirt. The next team coming from Teddy, who says, this is my squad. I play the same formation in game, and I've got 130,000 coins. Still saving packed car Walker and tradable. Potentially want to upgrade to Rara and Jota. Could save up for Son and Party. What do you think? That's interesting. So you've got Kyle Walker and tradable. Um, you want to... Yeah. I would personally here... James has got to go straight away. James has got to get out of this team instantly. With 130,000 coins, you're looking for a CDM in the Premier League. Allen is a great shout. Normal Allen. He's a little bit inflated, I'd imagine, right now. Um, there's a few options you can go with, though. Uh, as it's a new FIFA, I need to double check because um, I know for a fact I'm going to miss out some really good options. But there are some really good options in the Premier League this year that you can go with. I really like Wijnaldum, but he's quite expensive. Uh, I wouldn't recommend paying that much for Wijnaldum personally. Um, who else do we have that you can go for? Partey is definitely a really good shout. Partey would work pretty well in your squad. Kovacic would work pretty well if you like that more offensive CDM. I think he'd work pretty well. I'm not entirely sure about Rodrigo at Cam and Jimenez up top. I understand why you've got Jimenez, but I would maybe... If you like Hammers, go Hammers at Cam Rodrigo up top. Um, Rodrigo's passing stat is not ideal for a Cam, in my opinion, especially a lone Cam in a formation like that. Um, what we say for Rodrigo, he's like 70-something passing um where is he here he is what's his passing like 76 it's just not ideal i want 80 plus on my cam that's just my personal preference and by the way for another cdm and dd at left cdm would work really really well um i would say definitely go get yourself the ones to watch jota uh save yourself about 8k on that jota the rest of the team is pretty solid the rest of the team is definitely pretty solid um so you want you were saying that you want to upgrade to rara and jota you can save up for Son and Party. Son's definitely a good shout over at left mid. Party's I'd say Party over uh, Hammers, and then 
maybe Ndidi over to Rara. And you've got the quality to do that now, to be honest. Um, and then you just save it for Son. But apart from that, solid, solid squad. Next one coming from Mad Max. Hey, man, this is my team. I've got about 200,000 coins to work with, and I don't even know what to do. Dybala, Martinez, Brozovic, and Aaron Wan-Bissaka are untradeable. I have an untradeable Ericsson on the bench, if that helps. I play a 4-2-3-1 in game with Nyingalan and Brozovic as my two CDMs. You don't know what to do here. That's fair. This is a definitely a, a difficult position to be in, in my opinion. Um, you have a few different options. You can obviously go right side Premier League. You can go right side uh, English. The tough part here, obviously, everyone's going to be shouting uh, Mason Greenwood into their monitors. But Mason Greenwood, in my opinion, is not the, the best player here that you can go with. Um... I'm going to have a look. I think playing someone on 8 chemistry or playing wan on 8 chemistry is definitely the play here. Uh, I, yeah, no, let's go over here. Okay, so we're going to go right mids, right right wings, etc. from the Premier League. Let's have a quick look. Um, what options do you have? So you can play, for example, um, you can play the new Raphael card. You can play him. He's only about 6.4k and looks really solid. Uh, you can go for Riyad Mahrez, you can go for Lucas, you can go for Gareth Bale, you can go for Nicolas Pepe. A few different options there. There's no one realistically that gets you full chemistry here. That is a good option, though, in my opinion. Um, I would personally, if I had the choice here, I would go for either Nicolas Pepe, Gareth Bale, Lucas, or Raphael from Leeds. That was, that's who I'd go for over there on that right side. Um, for the rest of the team, maybe look to upgrade De Vries. Uh, I know he's getting the Delict link here. I'm just wondering if you can get the chemistry a little bit better here. Um, I, I'm not a big fan of De Vries. I did actually use De Vries at the start of the year. Wasn't a big fan of him. There are a few decent options in the, in the City out this year. Uh, four centre-backs and De Vries, in my opinion, is not one of them. But apart from that, the rest of the team is really decent. Um, we've already done Teddy's team. We've got Logan's team next. Hi, Haber. I have around 300,000 coins, all tradable team, and I play a 4-4-2 in game. Also packs mid Vieira before I get called credit card FC for the 10th time. Can confirm Logan did pack pull that mid Vieira. Um, he actually came on the stream a while ago and, and was saying about the pack pull Vieira, which GG, by the way. Uh, this is a incredible team. How do you find Ben Yedda? Because I used Ben Yedda and he didn't feel like the same Ben Yedda as last year. And his stamina for me played a big part. But I have heard non-stop good things about Benito, which is very interesting. And one of the things that I love about FIFA is that you can have opposing opinions regarding the game. Um, you've got 300,000 coins here. I think uh, Andy Robertson at left back or Alex... In fact, go for Alex Tellers at left back. The main United one is about 20k extinct. But if you can snipe one for 20k, he's a phenomenal left back. And that's not even just bias. He actually is probably my favorite left back this year. Barfell and Mendy, which you can't get on chemistry here. Uh, Wijnaldum insane. Suzuko insane. That right side is fantastic. The rest of this team is a 10 out of 10. Um, if you get Alex Tellers at left back, that this is genuinely such a perfect team. And I guarantee it plays so well. Congratulations on the Vieira, by the way. And congratulations on the team. That's absolutely insane. Uh, we've got XZY's team next. He's got 250,000 coins for improvements. Uh, and this is what his team is currently looking like. Interesting. You're playing a lot of plays off chemistry here, which I find very interesting. Um... What would I do here for improvements? I would say you can probably go with uh, Sissoko over Ndidi. Hear me out, because I know that's technically a downgrade, but it's actually Sissoko is a better player in game than Ndidi, maybe. Probably, I don't know, maybe not. Uh, but you can go with Sissoko over Ndidi and play Sissoko at Cam. Then you can put Dominic Calvert-Lewin at right centre mid and get yourself Kyle Walker at right back. Joe Gomez gets full chemistry. In fact, everyone bar... Sissoko gets full chemistry and Sen Maximin gets full chemistry there as well. And that works really, really well. Um, I'll be honest with you. I wasn't the biggest fan of Ricardo Pereira when I used him. Kyle Walker has been the best rep right back in the game for me so far. And I'm a big fan of him. Um, and that would definitely work out in some really good chemistry there. Decent team though. Very decent team. Uh, we've got Jacob's team next. Hello, Haber. Here is my team. Kuda Bali and Werner are untradeable. The rest is tradable. I have 470,000 coins. You guys have a lot of coins early on. I know, obviously, I've got a lot of coins due to opening packs, but you guys seem to have a lot of coins early on. I think that this game, like, due to the rival rewards and stuff, I think there's just a lot of coins in the game at the minute. Um, uh, currently, we'll save up. Have a nice day. Love the vid. PS got Ake for my once to watch pack. Hey, GG on that. I got Osman. Okay, well, this is actually a well-built team again. Uh, Kimmich and Goretzka, I think, are really OP. Uh, you've got the German, just absolute beast up top in Werner. 
Um, this is a really good team. I like the centre-back partnership. One thing I will say, though, is I think this year, having a little bit of agility and balance in one of your centre-backs works really well, and neither of your centre-backs has that. But I understand, obviously, they get the link with uh, Mertens. I'm just wondering if there is a better 2CB centre-forward partnership you can go with here that would work. Hmm. I am interested because... If you can, that would work really, really well. Now, you can you can go big, right? And you can go, for example, um, you can go for Joe Gomez, right center back. Van Dyke, left center back. Allison in goal. And then go for, like, a Lewandowski at striker. Um, although, you know, you seem to like your, your agile players, so that probably wouldn't be ideal for you. Maybe you go with a Marco Royce and play him at striker in that center mid spot. That would probably work quite well. Um, apart from that though, like there's not a whole lot you can do to improve this team. Maybe just up up upgrading the left side then after, uh, you can go with the likes of Regu Regulon and, uh, Son over on the left side, for example, when you've eventually got enough coins for that. And that would be a huge upgrade to the team. But apart from that, uh, everything else is fantastic, mate. You've got a really, really good team. I'm, I'm genuinely surprised at how good your guys' teams are right now in the game. Like these are really good teams. We have got Sir Maris something Rashford. Uh, Bell, Tonali, uh, Dybala, Nabry, Hernandez, Klosterman are untradeable. Got 30,000 coins. I'll play a 4 2 3 one in game. You've got untradeable Bale. GG on that. That's actually... I'm pretty jealous about that. All right. Right back. Get yourself someone better than than Danny DeCosta, please. Um, who can you go with at right back? That would work really, really well. German right backs, guys. In the comments down below, let me know. Because I know there is one. I just cannot for the life of me think who it is. And it's not Sven, all right? Don't say. Um, no, the rest of it is though really good to be honest this team is 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 really really good what i would say is maybe save up to get up meccano's in form at left center back would get you full chemistry uh on the card i mean not in the whole team but on the card i get you full chemistry um i like dabala i like lataro martinez i like rabio i like tonali yeah everything else is really decent let me know how you like nabri without the pace i'd love to hear your thoughts and feedback on that now i'm pretty sure have we done jamie's no we've not done jamie's yet i've got seventy thousand coins to play a 442 in game but yet it is the only untradeable open to anything love the content wow okay interesting this kind of left side's decent i've got a very similar left side on the rosa glory account i would say maybe huh you could change this right side up pretty easily right so you could go you could go, for example, keep this how it is, but maybe get yourself like an Alwar at, at, at right centre mid and get yourself like, I don't know, an Akone at right mid. And then go with a like Konate slash Upamecano right centre back, Mukiele right back, if you really wanted to change. But that's the only thing I can really recommend at this stage because at the minute... I would wait until I've got a lot of coins to start upgrading massively because this team will work until you've got a lot of coins to upgrade massively. So I would just kind of hold on to your coins, wait, and, and just play the game for a little while and grind your way up. And the last team for this episode is going to be Kian's team, a 4-2-3-1 in game. Uh, and this is what his team is currently looking like. It's it's a budget team. This is this is what more of what I was expecting, to be honest. I mean, it's a decent team. I would say... Hmm. I would say here save up for kimpembe right center back left center back get yourself mario hermoso um and then i would save up at striker for just a better striker whether you could save up for like a ben Yedder or something that'd be a really good addition to the squad but apart from that he's a decent starter teammate and best of luck with it but that's it for this episode uh i won't lie to you i am running on no sleep today so if i've made mistakes or stuttered or slurred my words or anything like that i do apologize uh it just sometimes happens when i'm really tired but thank you for the uh, support on the series um i will be bringing these back for two a week uh starting in the next few weeks i'll let you guys know on twitter and stuff like that when we're doing two a week but thank you for the epic support make sure to check out the socials link in the description and i'll see you later later